Hey guys, I thought I'd share some moments from a small gang of authors. As you know, I am a self-published author and blogger at the Toy Box of Words, but I'm also the co-manager of an author blogger community. Hashtag our author gang is a group of authors who blog together and we support one another. We all bring something different to the table and we just kind of have fun traversing the publishing and blogging world together. We also have a open uh, group on Facebook.com and it's just kind of a discussion type group. So today I thought I would highlight some of the discussions we had in the month of September. This group is open and we kind of try to appeal to both authors and readers with our discussions and we do have like threads that we allow book promotion to take place but that's not the main focus of our group so if you do visit our group you're not going to see just like you know book promotion after book promotion after book promotion we do do that but it's really more of a discussion group so i thought i would share some of the things that we discussed so let's see, first up, at the beginning of the month, we did announce that we reached um, 180,000 views on our blog, and we're actually really close to 200,000 views. So we posted that in the group, and we, you know, kind of discussed it. A lot of people congratulated us, and so if you would like to congratulate us, we'd really appreciate it. I mean, we all do what we do because we love it, but whenever we can get that feedback from readers, it just means a lot to us and motivates us to do even more than we've already done. So let's see. All right, so then we had a few authors weigh in on the Amazon marketing services. And basically our discussion was about whether or not the services worked for them, whether anyone had or hadn't tried it. So that was an interesting discussion. And then later, you know, being the bookish group that this is, we had a discussion about the effectiveness of book covers to sell books. And this is a really good discussion because even readers can offer their feedback on whether or not they were interested in a book based on the book cover. So of course, if we talked about book covers, that eventually led into a discussion about book trailers. This one was a little bit different because it was it was more of like do people even look at book trailers like is that still a thing so that's an interesting discussion yeah and of course i mean would we really be a bookish group if we didn't talk about book reviews and so this particular discussion was more about you know whether or not you do write a, a book review or you don't write a book review so that was interesting and then um, that we had a discussion about the use of a PA, a personal assistant. Have you ever tried one or maybe a virtual assistant? I was actually a personal assistant for a very brief time and I kind of shared a little bit of my experience. And so that was an interesting discussion you could always um, contribute to as well. And, you know, a lot of times you hear the question, you know, what would your dream job be? But in our group, we decided to flip that and we had a little discussion about the types of jobs that no one wants to get stuck with. Oh, yeah, and then I asked the question, um, does being an introvert or an extrovert play a role in the types of books you choose to read? And that was an interesting discussion. I also asked about whether or not you read the acknowledgments that authors include at the ends of their books. It seemed to be about 50-50 in the discussion, but that's definitely worth checking out. Um, for our science fiction lovers, we also had a day where we were asking for recommendations for your favorite alien invasion novels, and that was pretty cool. And so we had a discussion where we mentioned that a lot of times authors find themselves in their books, and so that's more of a, a thing that authors will relate to, but it could be interesting for readers to know that some of your favorite characters might actually be based on traits from the author themselves. And on uh, on the flip side of that, we also talked about how sometimes uh, friends and family end up being in our stories. And that's actually really cool because even as a reader, sometimes when you're reading a book and you relate to a character, that character may remind you of someone you know. So that was an interesting discussion. And we had a very 
interesting, uh, entertaining discussion about the use of certain words, words that you either don't like using or are afraid of using because you always use them wrong. That was a fun discussion. Um, we had a discussion about um, which point of view you prefer to read, first or third. That was an interesting discussion. And then I also had asked about what, you know, the coming of fall means to you. And I did acknowledge that it's not fall everywhere, but that was a fun um, discussion that you could always kind of join in on. And of course, these are not all the things we discussed in the month of September, but these were just kind of some of the highlights to let you know what we had going on in the month of September. If you want to check out any of the links below about specific discussions, I do have them there. So you could always join in. It is an open Facebook group, so you can click on there and be part of the discussion. Or you could leave me a comment below and let me know your two cents on the matter. And that's all I have for now. Bye-bye.